Illinois State has a strong tennis, men's tennis program, but there are a lot of things that fans do not know about this team. TV10's Chris Newman explains more on the uniqueness of the tennis program. Forehand. All right, so you have that. Backhand. Bump. Sir. Three of the most essential pieces to any tennis player's game. Another vital component, communication. When it comes to the ISU tennis team, communication and language are seen differently to each and every player, as almost none of them come from the same country. It takes a little time. Uh, you try not to put pressure on those guys. With six of the team's eight players coming from outside the United States and spanning four continents of the globe, one would think that this would be the biggest problem a team could face. But to these teammates, working to understand one another better, in fact, strengthens their team. It just comes with practice. I mean, the more off, like the first time we played, it was a little difficult, but got easier and easier as it went along. I mean, he speaks pretty good English, and uh, so do I, so, yeah, it's not, communication is really not a problem. Many members of the team would even say that tennis is a language spoken by any who pick up a racket. I think everyone speaks, like, tennis language, so in Brazil we use, like, terms in English and in all South America as well, so we pretty much know how to speak with each other. It's safe to say that recruiting, even 10 years ago, could have been very difficult. But with social media as popular and accessible as it is today, recruiting is as easy as checking out an uploaded YouTube video. It's, it's a lot different than how it used to be, where uh, you, you made either a VHS tape or a CD and you mailed it you know, to every coach. It's time-consuming, costly, whereas now I can have a video, I can tell a kid, you know what, let me see uh, certain parts of the game. They can probably the same day go out with their coach, make a video, email it to me later that night. With tennis continuing to grow as a sport, this new avenue helps athletes find the right fit for their game. He saw my videos and we, we Skype a lot, like more, probably one month we were Skyping almost every day. He was explaining his school. I was like super interesting about school. I was checking the website, checking videos, YouTube, like trying to find like if this would be the perfect place for me and, and it was. And as the team heads toward the end of their season, they continually watch for new players through the web that could join their multinational group, as well as help push their team towards an NCAA tournament berth. Reporting for TV10, I'm Chris Newman.